Parabola is an important construction in engineering and technical drawing as its application can be seen in many important areas of technology such as satellite dishes, automobile headlights, parabolic reflector heaters, golden gate bridge, fountains etc. Welcome to iTech Engineering and Technical Drawing Tutorial. In this video I will be showing you how to draw a parabola using circumscribing rectangle method. To draw a parabola using circumscribing rectangle method, the first step is to draw a rectangle. The length and breadth of the rectangle you are to draw depends on the way you want your parabola to look. I drew a square because I want the height and base of my parabola to be equal in length. The next thing I will do is to draw a vertical line to divide the rectangle into two equal parts. This step can be done this way. I will label the point where the vertical line intersects the square at the top zero. The next step I will take is to use my compass to mark off points equal in length on the right side of point zero. This step can be done this way. Having done that, I will label the points I marked, 1, 2, 3, 4, and the end of the line 5. Next I will draw vertical line from the points I marked to the bottom of the square. These line must be parallel to the vertical line from point 0, and should be thin dashes. Having done that, I will repeat these same procedures on the other half of the rectangle. the next thing I will do is to mark off four points equal in length from point five on the right side of the rectangle. I will perform this step using my compass. Having done that, I will label the points 1, 2, 3, 4, and the end of the line 5. The next thing I will do is to draw lines from the point I just marked to point O.
Repeat these same procedures on the other half of the rectangle. Of these steps, it is time to produce the locus of the parabola. To produce the locus of the parabola, I will use my French curve to draw a curve passing through the points where the lines I drew from point O intersects the vertical lines. I'm talking about these points I highlighted with red. Have successfully drawn a parabola using circumscribing rectangle method. You can always follow these steps to draw any given parabola using circumscribing rectangle method. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to this channel so you can get more videos from us. Also let us know your opinion and how you feel about this video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you find it helpful. See you in my next video.